Hey there, thanks for checking out Presenter Basics. I'm your host, Christina Deloma. This lesson is on how to prepare for a taping. Preparation is key when it comes to having a successful taping and keeping a few things in mind will make your day go very smooth. So the first thing is know all the details. Where are you supposed to be? What time? Who's your call sheet? Who are your contacts? Having all those things, knowing all those things beforehand is really going to start your day off on the right foot of shooting. And the way you go about knowing those things is having kind of a checklist for yourself. Do I know all just the basic elements, what the time is, how long I'm shooting for, are there any breaks available, is there going to be makeup and hair there? So know all the details before you start. Uh, make sure another key element is that your hair and makeup is situated. How you come across is honestly 60% of your job because uh, someone could be going by a screen or a phone or a tablet and have you on mute to start. So they don't know what you're saying. It's how you look that is really gonna keep them watching or not. Makeup, hair, outfit choice. Do you know what you're supposed to be wearing? Do you reflect where your environment is? Having all those things just put away and just knowing the morning you wake up of what you're going to wear, leave it enough time to do your hair and your makeup if you need it are going to start you once again, make your day a lot better if you know your hair and your makeup situation. Another way to prepare is to go over your script. Do you have any lines? Is there something that's new? Even if you go over your script um, the day of, and then again, or the day before, and then say the morning of if you have a production meeting, that script is going to be key. The more you familiarize yourself with the script, the better off you're going to be because you can adjust rather than taking it all in as being different. And that's just gonna set you up again for success knowing that script. The last thing you should do to prepare is make sure you go out of your way to communicate to whoever is putting this, this appearance together. If it's a producer, if it's a photographer, it's if your executive producer or whomever it is, ask them the day before, okay, what is it again you're expecting of me? Were there any changes? Has everyone else been told what I'm going to be doing? Um, are the people that I'm meeting prepared to be met? Do they, do they know I'm even coming? Are they expecting me as a talent or are they expecting someone else? Asking the person who is putting all of this together for you, all those last minute details and confirming everything you can, again, will make your day of preparation just so much better because you're not gonna be flustered. The thing you wanna take away from being prepared is that it's kind of weird to be talking in front of the camera because you're not just talking to a camera with a light and a house often. A lot of times you're talking with people, you're traveling to locations, you're supposed to be having a meetup, or maybe you're the host who's in charge of kind of producing and hosting at the same time. Knowing your role really is the last thing you can do to prepare. And understanding what the expectations of you are is going to make that whole day better because at the end of the day, or when you arrive I should say, you wanna make sure that you are feeling as though, I got this, I don't really have any questions, I'm just gonna ask do I have any, but if anyone else has any questions, but you've got what you're doing because you know. And taking that time to prepare is going to set you up for an amazing taping experience and the outcome is going to be something you're definitely gonna to wanna to add to your reel. For more lessons, be sure to check out the other videos in this series.